the current project area and where we're at right now, this field, these two field system, these two field cells, as well as the irrigation ditch, provide enough of a sample for us to omit further investigation to the east of here because of the research questions that we've designed for this area, we don't believe that there's any new information to be gathered from here. We believe that the information that would be redundant there. And at this point, we have an exposure that we know we have cultural activity here. You can see these, where the, the, the ground was just, it wasn't as muddy, but you can see the little impressions of his toes right there. took a number of molds, these are silicone, silicone molds of, uh, uh, of various uh, individual footprints and created these casts. Let's see, this one has uh, toe impressions, the heel impressions. This one, the mud was a little softer and they really dug in. So you, you just completely floored when you first saw these, huh? <laughs> I was laughing and crying at the same time. <laughs> yeah, it was, it, it, I'm so passionate about archeology span and what I do. And this type of excavating, uh, I came up with this. And it's the norm now in archeology. span Took molds of uh, a couple of larger areas. Uh, and I believe each mold was partitioned into four panels and this is just an example of one of the panels but you can see in the corner of this one these two smaller probable toddler footprints but that's the cast he made uh, off of the mold which is behind it. Further south in the same county owned parcel north of Curtis Road previous investigations have identified subsurface cultural deposits also, along the plant interconnect line, which was a uh, wastewater project along the frontage road, um, currently the loop over, overlies that, so we know we've had cultural deposits there. So we have known cultural deposits to the east, known cultural deposits to the south, we have this, therefore it provides us with uh, a, any further investigation south of here and north of Curtis Road, we anticipate and we have a pretty good idea of the stratigraphy in knowing how deep these cultural deposits are. However, the information that we gather here will structure research, further research um, south of this area.